This is Sheree Fultz, the director of York, York's Park and Recreation, and I just want to invite you on a tour of the renovations of the York Community Center. Thanks to York News Times for coming out and doing this report. Um, so this is the gym, and as you can look around, it is 100% pretty much redone. So we had new paint, we took out the ceiling, we um, added some safety features, which would be additional cable railings, fire alarms, fire, fire sprinklers in this facility, in this main gym area. The whole entire place got a new roof, which is great because it just rained, what, seven inches and we have no leaks. Um, fire alarms, fire sprinklers, a paint job, which is extremely needed and has really freshened the, up the place. We have also got new windows, new blinds are coming in. Um, asbestos removal and all the plumbing as well. So I'm eager to take you on this little tour of the York um, City Auditorium and we will open to the public March 22nd at our normal community center hour. So we'll be open Monday through Friday 6 a.m. to 9 p.m. Saturdays 10 to 6 and Sundays 1 to 5. So we can't wait to get our public back in our building and for you guys to utilize this. This will look like a complete thing. But this got a brand new drop ceiling in the North Dining Room. Um, painted new electrical so this was one of those extra um, $20,000 approvals that the City Council did um, if you recall that meeting all of this stuff was from 1970 all the electrical was from 1970 so when we actually got into it for the sprinklers and the alarms we realized it wasn't up to code so we brought it up to code so this North Dining Room got new electrical so they're out the whole entire thing along with fire alarms fire, fire sprinklers so, it's um, same thing in the kitchen. The kitchen got facelifts of paint. Even the counter, or even the cabinets got paint. Um, new electrical, new drop ceiling. Yeah. So once again, a lot of improvements have been done in the city auditorium, the main floor alone. But now we can go to the basement, and you can see kind of like the brands of the operation, which would be the boiler room, the air handlers, and that main um, congregational area. So. so this is the main area in the basement of the city auditorium. This is actually where we're gonna bring over some weight room equipment from the community center to provide for free for the community. So we have treadmills, ellipticals, free weights will be down here in this area. Uh, as you can see, this is where we stored everything during the renovation process. So we're still in the process of putting everything in storage and figuring out where everything needs to go. So this whole room can still be rented. It got um, new ductwork, new HVAC, which the whole entire building got. It had its, it has its own, or its old drop ceiling, but new electrical, fire alarms, fire sprinklers, new paint. Um, yeah, so we're excited. Everybody, you can come downstairs and use this stuff for free once we open on March 22nd. So, if, if you, so right now we're in the old boiler room of the city auditorium. So behind Eric used to be that big boiler that got retrofitted from a coal to a gas and now it is actually the air handler for the heat. And these two machines are the boilers. So um, it is amazing how technology has changed from the 40s to 2021. Everything is so much smaller, more efficient and compact. So um, I'm pretty sure he'll take pictures, but the space of this room is so, I mean, wide open that we could actually have it as storage. Whereas before it was a huge air handler. The air handler used to go up to those big old beds. Um, it was creepy down here, but now it's bright and you can find your way through. So yeah, a great update. All air handlers, so HVAC and heat is in this room. So the exterior of the city auditorium is also gonna see a facelift. So all stairs will now have railings. Um, the, the wheelchair ramps will also be modified for safer. So the, the handrail will wrap around to the, hand, the railing. And then we'll also bring in dirt to eliminate the fall surface or the fall size so we'll be doing that once it gets a little bit warmer as well so the whole exterior got new railings um 
dirt work and the back of the auditorium is also receiving some work just because of the size of the air conditioning units have definitely been condensed because of efficiency. Um, so we'll go ahead and we'll replace, like obviously we'll have to replant grass and do all that stuff as well. But thank you for coming along with the tour of the city auditorium. We are so excited to have it done and to be able to offer another safe and community facility for everybody in New York and the Sherman. Look at how nice this is.